welcome to a new Get Fit Bellina video. Today we're going to talk about lower belly fat. I have my tablet here because I wrote down some things that I want to mention in this video so I don't forget anything. So let's start. Lower belly fat is a very stubborn fat which a lot of us have, problem to, have a problem to get rid of. So is there a way to get rid of the lower belly fat? How long will it take? and what can you do so the first thing to know is that lower belly fat really depends on genetics because there are some people that have more fat in the legs or in the arms but they don't store a lot of fat around their belly area so they, are, they have a lot more naturally um, hourglass shape then there are people like me for example who store the most fat in the lower belly area and this is the most stubborn fat for me for example and the thing is you can't choose where your body is going to burn the fat the body chooses it uh, by itself and uh, the problem here is that where the fat comes first it also goes last so if you have really bad genetics and you have uh, no luck so you will lose fat around your breast area or maybe in your face or arms and legs but the um, lower belly fat will still stay there because it's really stubborn and you would have to lose a lot a huge amount of fat to get rid of that last area what is the problem here well as i mentioned your face might get way too thin making you look like a zombie especially if you're already older and you may not have the look you want and you may have to starve yourself to really get rid of that last belly fat and it's just uh, not worth it you can't um, enjoy eating out you can't enjoy things because you have less calories to consume when you want to reach that low body fat level but i have good and bad news the good one is there is a way to get rid of the lower belly fat and um, get a great shape. The bad news is that this is a longer way where you need a lot of patience and it can take some years. But it's definitely worth it. So what is the way to go? Well, if you don't have the genetics for an hourglass shape, you, will have to ch you would have to change in between gaining uh, muscle and losing weight so you would have some periods of gaining muscle losing weight that way you're going to build muscle get your calorie burning rate up and uh, that shapes your body if you gain muscle around the right areas for example shoulders and the back and also the booty this will give you an hourglass shape look and you will be uh, able to burn more fat by not starving yourself so if you change in between periods of gaining muscle and losing fat after a time you will get that desired hourglass shape and you will get rid of your lower belly fat another problem with that is that um, as it takes a lot of patience a lot of people are not willing to put in the work for a long time because a lot of people ex expect fast results but if you don't have the genetics for it you just have to accept that it really takes um, a lot longer than when you already have the hourglass shaped genetics. Then another difficult thing is the weight on the scale because we rely way too much on the weight on the scale. But if you're going to change your shape, there's a high possibility that the weight won't really change or even may go up. But Still, you will get a much better physique so that's why I recommend taking photos as well because then you'll see that the weight uh, on the scale doesn't say the whole truth about your shape so to get rid of the lower belly fat successfully you need three things one is patience the other one is consistency and the first one is trusting the process and those three things are really hard to follow because our mind plays tricks on us if, you, if we don't reach the results fast. So that's when a good coach comes in that can help you stay on track, 
that can assure you that your process will lead you to your goal and that will have your back when you're not sure if you're going the right way or not. So if you need any help with reaching your dream physique, don't hesitate to contact me. I would be happy to help you. So I'll see you next time. And don't forget, train smart, get fit.